Welcome to Good Mythical More. Craigslist has an area that you can type in a missed connection. Somebody that you wanted to connect with, but it didn't happen, and maybe they'll see it, and then they'll reach out, and you can connect what didn't happen, what mm. missed. Mm. We're mm. gonna read those, and we're gonna force some of those connections. We're gonna force connections. But first, Congratulations, Laney. You are a hashtag mythicality winner. That means you were repping that mythical merch out in the wild. Yeah, you are. Oh my, talk Speaking about wild. wild. Yeah. Got dogs draped over her arms and that Merle shirt looking good. Dogs make any picture 1000% better. That's also true. You know what we're gonna do for you, Laney? We're gonna send you a $30 mythical.com gift card so you can get even more merch. You'll get a hoodie for your dog if those are still in stock. Um, so we got this. We got these cards here. Um, we're just gonna pull these up, having not seen them at all. These are Craigslist missed connection posts, unaltered by us or our team. And we have to assume. We don't have to assume, but we shall assume. We're gonna assume that the connection has not been made. That yet. the connection has not been made yet. And that it's up to us to make it. Maybe they're all mythical beasts, and they're both watching. That's the premise. I, I like think. to believe that. My vegan goddess. Culver City. Oh. Saw you at the Trader Joe's last evening. We reached for the vegan chicken nuggets at the same time. <laughs> I'll let you have the last box. You had an orange jumpsuit on and freshly dyed green hair. Is this someone who has escaped? Yeah, from some sort of institution. Institution. Uh, they, they let you dye your hair green in institutions? I don't know. Depends. I'm not done though. Tell me what color my nails were and let's get a vegan picnic going. Tell, tell me what color, okay, so there's a test in this. This is smart, because mm -hmm. you just don't want someone, like two guys on an internet show to like, yeah. just psh, browse through the misconnections and then start c calling you up and saying, hey, I'm the one. Yeah, you got it. you mean, have to have proof of connection. I like this, I wonder if the other ones have that. Yeah, I doubt so, it. Um, I like the fact that this poster starts by saying, you know what, you are a vegan goddess. And I, I, I wanna connect with you. There's some flattery here. This is a well-written, uh, all bases covered Orange misconnection. Orange jumpsuit, freshly dyed green hair. Um, so, first of all, the chances that we've got two vegans in Culver City watching right now Pretty high. Very high. Yeah, almost a sure I, thing. I think, uh, you know, when I, you know, most mythical beasts are vegan. <laughs> most people are vegan. Right, who are we kidding? Uh, most people wear orange, wearing an orange jumpsuit, now that takes guts. How many, this is a question, how many vegans does it take are, to change a light bulb? Are Enjoying the chicken, and I'll notice that it's chicken without an E because that is the brand, like the chicken, the fake chicken, chicken oh. nuggets. Oh. So. Reaching for the chicken nuggets and your hands touch, it's like. It's romantic. Man, and I. What color were my nails? Man. I wasn't looking at your nails, I was looking at the chicken nuggets. I, I really feel for this, this these well, vegans. Well, where I was going with this is that if you've made the decision to be a vegan, and some people go all in on vegan, and they say, I'm just gonna eat just raw food, I'm gonna eat you know, fruits and vegetables, and I'm not gonna eat things that are trying to represent the world that I left, yeah, the yeah, meat yeah. eating, right? They're compatible. So, so I think that they're both at the same stage in their veganism. Yeah, they're weak vegans. So I think this is like vegan stage one, which is a good place to be, because you don't want your veganism to be kind of unequally yoked, as we would have said back in the day. Yeah, you, you, know wanna, both, you wanna both be fence, fence, straddle vegans. Right, so this is, you're at the right place because together. This could work, I really want, encourage I want each this other to happen. To continue in your veganism. And, and you know, because when a vegan gets with a meat eater, it's like, ah, it's, it, it's a slippery slope. It's a slippery slope. Can't work. So we, so basically, I think we have to spend all our time just on this one. We can't even move on. We have to make this connection happen. So we're gonna wait. Yeah, until you guys get together. Until you tell me what color we'll be the nails here. are. What color were the nails? I think we've done it. Just by virtue of talking about it, this, uh, this vegan goddess is now scrambling okay. um, to, to to go on the Craigslist missing connections okay. page. Problem solved. Do, I guess it does work. 
Well, it, there's got to be a reason it exists. There's got to be a reason it exists. They would have done away with it. Here's another one. Seniors at Seabridge in Oxnard. Oh, Oxnard. My favorite named town in all of uh, California. Um, I go on walks at Seabridge area, and I usually notice some good-looking older women and was wondering if any of them would mind if a younger man joined them for their walk. Oh, just a walk. So yeah, but uh, the thing I've learned not, about walks. In this is Oxnard, not. A, it's not okay. What the thing I've learned about walks in Oxnard is they never just end as a walk. You know what I'm Sometimes saying? Sometimes you might be limping. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, maybe later. Yeah. But oh, are you talking about like walking bowlegged? <laughs> <laughs> but especially at sea, the Sea Bridge area, I've heard a lot about the Sea Bridge area. Listen, Rhett. And there's some scandalous things going on there with the seniors. Here's the problem. This is not a missed connection. This is just this is a want ad. This is this is a this is a desperately wanting older women who walk ad. This is a proposition from a younger man who's into cougars. This is I don't I don't want I don't want to I don't want to have any Yeah, partners. we don't need to help this person. Yeah. Just go to Seabridge and walk, man. But we want to help you be safe. And that means wearing a mask. We got neon face masks at mythical.com. And when we say neon, what we don't mean is that they are the color neon. What we mean is that they're actually black, but they have neon words on them. They're, actually, one word, it says mythical over and over They're tasteful. Again. We and call they, them neon because- They're comfortable. Y'all seem to be into that. So we're starting to call more things neon that aren't. Missed connection number three. Ralph's Deli and Produce. Couldn't, You're hanging out. Couldn't talk. Sherman Oaks. Sherman Oaks. I've been to this Ralph's. And That's I have a, that talked Ralph, in it. That Ralph's has an escalator. The one in Sherman Oaks sure does. I remember it was the first escalator I've ever been on. <laughs> period. <laughs> <laughs> you caught me checking you out a couple of times in the market, and we laughed. We were both with somebody else, in quotes. Oh, were we? But that didn't stop us from some innocent flirting, <laughs> parentheses, a lot. I even lined up behind you, behind you. <laughs> Lining up behind you. In the checkout line, which was really kind of fun. <laughs> we didn't talk at all. Remember me? <laughs> so no test. You say, if you remember me, tell me, tell me something that was in my cart. You caught me checking you out. Here's the thing. And we laughed. You don't really need a test because if you do connect, you'd be like, oh, you're not her. You don't need a test for a misconnection. I guess it, unless the test is to not waste your time. But anyway, back on topic. Let me see that. I need to put it where I can see it. Well, no, the reason you need a test is because then the test becomes the, the physical meeting in, in person. And then you see, oh, you're not the person. Yeah, you've that's, already, that's awkward. You've arranged a meeting. Yeah, that's awkward. You want it to happen only online until you confirm and then you can move into the physical world. I love the fact you caught me checking you out a couple of times and in, we laughed. In the market. So, like, I mean, how often do you check somebody out and it makes them laugh? Not often. This is not reciprocal. <laughs> There's yeah. no yeah, way in like, hell. I was, I was checking you out and you were laughing at me. And I'm not I trying- I sensed a connection. I'm not trying to but be- But you were just laughing at me. Sexist here, but this is definitely a man. 100%. 100%. Okay. <laughs> this is a man. Uh, and I don't know if the other person was a man or a woman, but this person doing the checking out was definitely a man. And as Stevie has already pointed out, the laughing was probably uncomfortable laughing. Lafting, yeah. It was, in fact, I call that lafting. And when you line up behind them in the checkout line, which is kind of fun. What do you Checking mean? you out from behind was kind of fun. We didn't talk at all. I was just behind you in line. Remember me? That was fun. Yeah. You're a creeper, dude. Yeah. I mean, the coming, rock. Coming from somebody who's pretty creepy, I gotta say, this is, this is pretty creepy. Uh, but he, you know, if you're 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 milling around at the Ralph's. You are deli. not creepy. Oh, thanks, Stevie. <laughs> you're, taking, you're taking a number. It's a good place to meet somebody because you're like, hey, what's your number? Uh, got it. I got it. Right. Yeah. 
And then but you could be a, like, hey, but, what's your sign? But that's only at the deli counter. Only at the deli counter does that work. I wonder how... Hey, what number are you? Hold because, on, how many times? Because that's excellent. My, num- my number's five. How many five. times what's has your that happened at the deli counter? My number's five. What's your number? Yeah. Area code first, please. <laughs> yeah, I like that. That's smart. Married man. men who think they know how to pick up women are just talking out the butthole. Mm-hmm. Like us? I'm, I'm talking about us. Yeah. We're just talking out our rectums. You don't have to. We think, don't not, we, you don't have to specify have to. that. Like, you don't have to go from butthole to rectum. You don't, you know. It's Our like, sphincters are loosening. It doesn't have It sounds words like a biography. From butthole to rectums. <laughs> and Oxnard. Missing connection number four. Encounter I've after. I've heard beautiful. Oh. What? Oxnard? <laughs> no, no. I mean, maybe, 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 maybe It's the right beach. next to Ventura. It's got a beautiful. Sure, the beach. It's got a beautiful Don't go harbor. Inland. I mean, no, you know, no offense. It's the valley. It's fine. It's, Anderson it's fine. Beach. Anderson Pack has a whole album called Oxnard. I think he's from there. Yeah, it's farmland, Ben. Farmland. It's, it's like some farmland of it, and but then, some of it's not. Some of it looks like the rest of the valley. But out there in Ventura, it's where all there's all kinds of uh, like Ventura, action, action sports yeah. that happen out there. We got three more of these. Yeah, I, right. I don't. I don't want to leave any connections right missing because yeah, we got that one taken care of. Missing connection number four: encounter after dark. In Progress Park, Paramount area. Yeah. After dark encounter in a park. Don't go there a lot. Hey girl. Mm-hmm. Have not heard from you in a month. We used to meet up at Progress Park after dark for physical activities four to five times a week. <laughs> Call me. <laughs> what is this? This is like a fired personal trainer? Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, yeah. yeah. That's exactly. This is a night trainer. Yeah, forget that. This is a night trainer that didn't have a business card. So that's on the trainer. Craigslist gets creepy. Bicyclist at CSULB. That's California State University. Long Beach. LBC. You were riding your bike on West Campus Avenue. You were wearing tight spandex shorts with your jock strap visibly showing through. Very hot. (laughs) What? (laughs) Jock strap? What? We should ride together sometime. Let me know. Okay. This is what? this is from a man to a man, <laughs> right? I mean that that's where I'm going with this. Jocks. Okay. okay. Because we got a jock strap, and then we got somebody saying that it was very hot. I just okay. This yeah. is a man to a man. I'm st- okay. Long Beach, bicyclist, jock strap, jock strap, <laughs> visibly showing West hot. Campus Avenue. Hot. We should ride together sometime. Yeah, all, all signs point. You guys don't need Craigslist. <laughs> you don't need Craigslist. You'll figure it out. Trust me. I don't know what he means by that. I mean, I'm just saying. Just keep biking. I'm just saying that this, this You're on person, campus and you're biking. You don't need to be This person has probably already made a connection with someone else. And our final misconnection of the of the day. Fashion Island Starbucks in Newport Beach. That's a great Starbucks. I was guy with dark hair and eyes, tattoos, wearing light blue V-neck tee with white mask pulled down on my phone, mm. sitting outside of Starbucks. Okay, I remember. You, long, shiny, dark hair, pulled back in a tight ponytail with bright red lips wearing a black leather, I think. Could be faux leather. Pants. You gave me a nice stare down as you were around in the corner. I think you walked back to Macy's. <laughs> I'm kicking myself for not approaching you. Hope you see this. Ooh, this is this is sincere. This is detailed. This is... This. I we, think you walked back to Macy's. Th- we gotta, okay, okay. We gotta make this happen. Yeah, there's a lot of there's a lot in common here. All we by reading it, yeah, we made it happen. Right, right. Anything we add is just for us. Well, but I just want to point out the similarities. You got uh, you got a guy with dark hair and eyes. Yeah, he has eyes. Yeah, um, tattoos, light blue V neck, white mask, white mask pulled down. down on the phone, on the phone, painted a picture for you, and then and then uh, I am assuming this is a woman. 
Uh, long, shiny, dark hair. Dark hair? Dark hair and dark hair. Pull back. Pull back, And yeah. a tight ponytail. Tight. Bright red lips. Think about how the red lips and the blue V-neck will complement one another. Yeah, that would be good. And then black leather. Couldn't... I think. Couldn't tell because I didn't touch it. I just saw it. It's yeah, hard to tell if it's faux or real unless you caress it. Can I touch it? Not going to do that. You went to Macy's. Do I have your permission to touch it? <laughs> and she rounded the corner. She rounded the corner. Then She, she turned, rounded the corner. Then she saw him turn back around and went towards Macy's. I think... Is that what happened? <laughs> I think... Hold on. She rounded the corner and gave him a nice stare down. Then she walked back to Macy's. Yeah. So what is he... I don't... I think this... He. I think he missed... He missed something. I, I'm totally unraveling everything that we just said. I, they seemed so compatible until I realized exactly what happened was she saw him, was worried, and went to Macy's because Macy's has great security. Sanctuary, yeah. yeah. yeah he's like, not going to come in Macy's. Safety in Macy's. He's got tattoos. Safeties. Yeah. So yeah, hope, hopefully, hopefully. Hope you guys get together. Yeah. Protect yourself and others around you with our mythical neon face masks. Available now at mythical.com.